Hello again, everyone. It's Matt. And Chels. Today's Patreon request was brought to us by Jorg. Today we are checking out Mono Inc. and their song Children of the Dark featuring Tilo Wolf, Joachim Witt, and Chris Harms. The only one I am familiar with is Chris Harms. He's the lead singer of Lord of the Lost. Yes. The other two I am not familiar with. I'm familiar with none of them. The official video link is down below. Our links are down there as well. And please don't forget to... Like and subscribe. And hit the notification button. You'll remember Chris. Okay. Trust me. He has a very recognizable voice, in my opinion. I'm, I, I think we've heard at least one Mono Ink song on a, a live stream before. It's hard to tell. Completely honest. Uh, yeah. The original video link. I just did all that. Did you? Yes. Please play. So I'm just play. blanking out mm -hmm. myself today. Okay. That's Chris. Not at all the vocals I was expecting from that man. It's definitely very catchy. Very catchy.
I like that song. It was bouncy and catchy. It was really fun. I also really enjoyed how they did the video. thought it was cool that they showed the people out in the crowd. Mm-hmm. Which makes me wonder, was it a song written for the, like solely for their fans or fans of metal in general? Hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. We're all the children of the dark. Well, I... The whole, you don't get who we are, you know, that part kind of made me think. Because metalheads are very misunderstood people. Very, very misunderstood. Uh, But anyway, the song was fun. My only thing was, is it got a little repetitive by the end for me. Yes. Yeah. I would have to agree. That was was my only thing. Uh, The guest spots, I'm not familiar with Tilo or, I hope I said his name right, Joaquin. Uh, not familiar with either of them. Tilo's vocals kind of shocked me. Not at all the vocals I was expecting. I was expecting more like 80s metal sound. You yeah. Know? Yeah, it was more like a gritty. Yeah, almost goblin mm-hmm. in some aspects of it. Um, but did you recognize Chris? I did. Yeah. I, yes. I enjoyed his part in this song. That's a good song. Like uh, overall, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10 as well. It's definitely going to stay stuck in my head, though. Definitely. Like, it was repetitive to the point that you're going to remember this song the rest of the day. Yes. True facts. Yes. Thank Thank you, you, Jorg. Thank you, Jorg. And thank you to everyone that watched this reaction. And we'll see you back here next time. Bye. Goodbye.